got that exciting little moment out of the way, let's get to the video. Every day I ride to work and I bring lunch with me, I bring some other stuff with me, but I've changed how I do it. I used to use this Sidichi dry bag. 10 liters, waterproof, straps right on the back. I used rock straps, you could set up other options, but I don't use it anymore. And it's not necessarily that there's anything wrong with the bag, so much as it wasn't the right bag for my use. And the reason is simple. To get into it, you had to open the bag and come into it from the top, and you couldn't really easily get to everything that is in it, particularly if it's still strapped to the bike. Now what I swapped to, a Nelson Rig tailbag, commuter tailbag. These are not waterproof by default, they're a little water resistant, but not much. However, I sprayed mine with a silicone waterproofing spray, and particularly the bottom and the back, because you can see here, it sticks out a fair bit. And oh yeah, that acts as a rear fender. No joke, that's my rear fender. It protects me from getting rain spray, and it does a good job. More importantly, beyond the rain spray factor, I can get to things from the top. So I can get to everything in there easily. It's got some organization. It doesn't hold a whole lot more unless you expand it, which I'll, I'll show in a bit. I'm not gonna totally expand it. And I, I had only strapped out one side, so. <laughs> but that's how you get it, you expand it. You unzip that zipper all the way around and basically lift the top and you almost double the capacity. And the key is, you have to waterproof it. Just putting the rain cover on it, mm, you're getting it wet from below most of the time as well. It did not work so well. So anyway, take care, have fun, stay safe, keep the rubber side down.